Okay, if anything bad happens to her, I want you to call me at work. Okay, buddy? Sure, Dad. Good. Because then I will come right home and I will put you through that fucking wall. Have a great day, Princess. It's history! It's not going anywhere! When I get home tonight, I want to see half of those assignments completed, or as God is my witness, I will put you through that fucking wall! We're outside, genius! There is no wall! Then I will build one, and I will fucking put you through it! Breaks my heart to tell you, but, uh, she decided to turn it down. Really? Afraid so. She said there's no job more important than being a mother to three beautiful miracles. Get back in your room before I put you through that fucking wall! Oh, no, buddy! Oh, so help me God. If I started building walls today and didn't stop for the next ten years, there still wouldn't be enough of them to fucking put you through! I will have you thrown out of here, mister, if you don't get your emotions under control! My emotions? You mean my love for my own child? Let me tell you something, Beatrice. I don't know what country you're from, but I didn't die for five minutes on a Korean battlefield to come home and be disrespected by a woman like you. You think because I'm unemployed you can just shove me and my family to the back of the line, huh? Well, not on my watch. If you don't get her a doctor right now, before all these other low-life pieces of shit, then I will follow you to whatever home for dried up old hags you live in, slap the cat food out of your mouth, grab you by your camel huff, and put you through that fucking wall! Oh boy. Hey Mozart, it's the warden. Even though you hate me, I still want you to eat. Open the door. <laughs> Come on, I got you extra meatballs for good behavior. Where are you? Kevin? Yeah, for Christ's sake! Out of the gulag, into the spotlight! <laughs> Get the fuck back here, I forbid you! My dreams are not formidable! You lying little shit! I learned it from the best! You come back here, I'll put you and your smart mouth through that fucking wall! Come on, it's almost seven, hurry it up! Let's go, chop chop! Since when do you read? Since when do you care? Since I'm your father and I'll put you through that fucking wall. Move your ass, you're gonna be late! But Dad! But nothing! Oh, sorry, Princess, I thought you were Bill. Oh, thank you! Thank you so much! Tell us, Henrietta, how did you come up with this brilliant invention of yours? Well, it's an amazing story. I can't take credit for it. Chin up, tits out, Sue. It's your time to shine. God gave me the idea when my washing machine broke down. <gasps> that resonates! Uh, you should have seen the first prototype I built in my garage. Oh my god, she's stealing it? Not necessarily. My husband, Frank, wanted to put it through a wall! Oh yeah, she's stealing it. Listen up! Today's the kickoff to summer. We're gonna go to the Memorial Day Parade and have a great time all together as a family. Like we do every year. You guys ready to have some fun? Yes. Good. Because if either of you two boys messes this day up for me, so help me God, I will fold these chairs up with your head still in them, and I'll put you right through the fucking wall. <laughs> Want one? Uh, okay. I've never had a cigarette before. Just the candy kind. This is candy. One candy. You ever think about how you're gonna die? It's probably gonna be my dad putting me through a fucking wall. Aww. He sounds like a real cocksucker. <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on, Sue. He was probably just letting off some steam. You know how many times the cops would be called if somebody heard the shit that comes out of my mouth? Christ, the state would have taken the kids away years ago. We're not that lucky. You're lucky I don't put your head through that fucking wall! And get a haircut, you look like a lesbian! Checking on the dog, hon. I'm good with dogs. I'll put you through that fucking wall! <laughs> How much shit can what? Ow! Quit fucking around and hang it up! As you wish, father. Ah, you father me. I'll put you through that fucking wall. I heard cereal through the phone. We've been through all this before. 
Yelling at him only makes things worse. Look, I yell at Kevin because it's the only way to get him to listen. But he's not listening! Then what the fuck am I supposed to do? I put him through a wall, but I don't have a permit! Well, here's something hilarious. <laughs> You're gonna cry for your mommy, you spoiled brat. Clean this mess up before I drop you down that fucking well. We don't have a well. It's an expression. Christ, you're just like your mother. That's why I changed it to put you through a wall. Because there's always a wall. That was my fuck you to my old man.